Guess what time it is? It's our favorite Reddit, Am I the Asshole? Here we go. Am I the asshole for not telling the guy I was dating that my daughter is biracial? It's already starting like you're not an <laughs> asshole. But wow. here we go. So far, this is great. Okay. I gotta take off my glasses. My new man is one. part of the KKK. <laughs> he really believes in this stuff. And I, and, I, and I don't love it, but you know what? I respect him. Am I the asshole? <laughs> I started dating this guy I met in January of this year. We went on a few dates here and there, but nothing serious. In March, we all went into lockdown, so he and I texted back and forth, spoke on the phone, and video chatted. Our restrictions just started to lift here, and I was really liking this guy, so we decided to hang out and go on a hike. After the hike, we went back to his place to watch a movie and have dinner, and probably fuck. <laughs> Absolutely fuck. I was at his place, place for a couple of hours, and we started talking about our daughters. He also has a daughter, who is close okay. in mind to age and he had never met my daughter because I don't bring men around my child unless it's a serious relationship. Okay. It's good. He began showing me pics of his daughter, so I did the same. When I was swiping through pics of her, he asked me if she was mixed. I told him, yeah, and that was my, and my ex-husband is black. He then started telling me that I should have told him this in the beginning. <laughs> I didn't understand because I've never experienced this before. I've always been upfront with the few guys I dated that I have a child, but I never thought it was important for me to make sure to add that she's biracial. He started saying that he didn't think he could go on dating me because his family's <laughs> very against interracial dating and they would never accept him dating someone with a child who's mixed. He's He kept saying over and over that I should have told him because now he's hurt because he really liked me. I ended up going off on him and left. He's Good. been texting me to apologize and you trying to call. You've been texting me to apologize? Yeah, I guess to apologize to her. Oh. oh, not like apologize now. I thought he was like, I was, he was texting me to apologize. <laughs> He's like, apologize, all caps. <laughs> How dare you not tell me you had a mixed child? Oh shit! <laughs> Imagine being serious about it. <laughs> Your phone goes ding, 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 ding. He's like, apologize, apologize, apologize. A P O S. I, like, I demand you say sorry. I was like, so for me, so far he's in the wrong. So that seemed like something he would do. <laughs> True. That makes sense. Apologize. He also sends a gif of a girl being like, <laughs> What's up, dude? <laughs> When's it coming? <laughs> I can't believe I was Eskimo Brothers with a black guy. Anyways, um, he goes, I ended up, she says, I ended up black blocking him. I told some of my friends and family members about this, and the response has been about half and half. So this is the part that kind of shocked me, right? Some say I should have told him, while others say he's the asshole. I haven't dated much since my divorce, so now I'm wondering if this is something I need to tell a date right away? No! I don't get it, and I don't think I did anything wrong, so I'll let you guys be the judge. No, she did Listen, nothing wrong. Racism no. got solved a long time ago. Yeah, That's it doesn't exist. Thought. It's completely solved. But I mean, is it? Is is it because I'm in LA and I that's just my world? Imagine if you were only like a quarter or whatever else, right? And then you look at the family photos and they're like, your grandfather was Asian? <laughs> Why didn't you tell me? You're a mixed person? Yeah. So the, this guy's worried about the family album that he's it worried about. Seems like no, it. he he <laughs> has his own shit. That's all. Look, everyone, people love to do the family thing. It's so easy, but- oh, blame it on the family? Right, but he's interacting with this chick. He's the one with, in a relationship with this chick. Yeah, he yeah. doesn't have to make her feel bad. He's like, once every 10 years when we go to the family reunion, yeah. someone might say something. <laughs> right, and he could make her feel good, by the way. He'd be like, yo, I love you, I love your kid, this is awesome, but your family's fucked up, or my family's fucked up. You don't know my family, yeah. He didn't do that shit. No, so him. that must mean that those thoughts are also his thoughts. For yeah. sure, yeah. for it's sure. It's obvious. Absolutely. Yeah. It's kind of a shocker though, because she thought, you know, she's like, I didn't really think this will be happening. So she she thought she was kind of na naive to think that, you know, this kind of stuff didn't happen in her area. He's yeah. he's doing everything but saying I am offended by this, which he should say immediately. <laughs> but <laughs> well, he shouldn't admit it ever. But well, I'm glad no, he did though. Yeah. Well, he's well, not well, wasting her time yeah, for her at least. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, for her own sake at least. So for her, she was like, it didn't even occur to her because she was more worried about potential pedophiles having a daughter and bringing new mm. strangers into the house. <laughs> That's also oh. wild. <laughs> Yeah, She's like, I already gotta worry about that. Now I gotta worry about guys who- I'll suck this guy's dick, but you better not be a pedophile. That's wild. I, I feel like that that's a more of a legit concern than the whole racist one. Yeah, well, I think- I, think I would think that first as a problem well, before for going works, to- For me, it works in layers, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. the first one would be like, I just want to make sure I show my kids stability. 
And then the next day I would be like, well, I don't want to bring strangers around my daughter because, you know, the sexual, but I don't think that would be my first go-to, like, like, I don't want them raping my kid. I'd be like, no, I just don't want them to be an asshole or see them mistreating me. You yeah. know what I mean? Because yeah. yeah. imagine like, okay, like you're watching uh, Step Brothers, right? And then it's the beginning opening scene where the, the mom and the dad are about to hook up and she's like, oh, uh, I gotta tell you something, I have a, da like a son. And then he's like, oh, I have a son that's four years old and lives at home. And then they start making out, oh, just to let you know, he's, uh, uh, yeah, he's like biracial. And then he just dips. That'd be fucked up. It would be. That'd yeah, because everything was fine. Usually I would think like he would have dipped if she was like, oh, I had a daughter. And he was like, oh, actually, like I'm, I don't want that. Which is still kind of like weird, but it depends on how you want that, but. But the you, funny part is that he thinks it's news to break to them, right? Yeah. Hey, just so you know, I have a biracial kid. Yeah, I know, I have right? to break it to you. And isn't that weirder? Are you sitting down? Isn't that weirder to talk about your kid and be like, hey, so I have this kid, so whatever, he's into soccer and he's part black. Like who, who says, who speaks like that? Yeah, it should never come up. Cause yeah. it's a pejorative. Well, it is, it is. Cause then like, um. What if he just has a small dick? And that's what it is, and he just, yeah, he just knows, he, he just knows like, the stereotype. Oh, oh, uh, oh, oh, like, cause then the biracial has a bigger one? What's the girl? I think, yeah, no, 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 I'm just saying, no, no, but he's thinking Oh, the that. last boyfriend had exactly. a bigger dick. Exactly. Oh, oh. Mm -hmm. I thought you meant he just had a small dick and he was just trying no, to get out of sex with Nelson's her. the only one that gets me in this group. Okay? I got it now. No, I wouldn't say that. Gio's trying to say, Damn, you're alone, Gio. Gio's trying to say that all black guys have huge dicks. I said the stereotype. No, that's what you, that's what you believe. <laughs> hey. And it's a belief system and it's fine. Well, you are, I, from, according to Nikki, you have a big dick. Uh, it's not true. It's a, it's a complete myth. <laughs> My penis is very small. Well, I guess being in LA, sometimes um, we are guilty of being in an LA bubble and how forward and relaxed true. it is. Yeah, here. really. Like, when I get introduced to people and it's... I'm not going to say who does it more, but it's like, oh, this is my friend Adim. He's Afghan. You should say who does it more. Yeah, who does you it just more? told White us people. who did. <laughs> do we? Yeah. Do I take responsibility? You're, you're I take responsibility. I didn't know you were right. I am uh, pretty Aryan. <laughs> <Some have. laughs> I think so. I, I certainly thought so. Maybe you should get your eyes. Afghan to Nadim. I don't know. I have to write I'm white on. You know what though? Being Afghan. Because I come Aryan. from the Aryan mountain range. You are. Oh, really? Yeah. They are the true Aryans. I'm there. I'm the Aryan. Ooh, the in your they're face. The Ooh. Yeah. They're from the Caucasus. Joe, 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 I'm being serious right now. Don't say that shit. But you don't even have blue eyes. <laughs> you don't even don't have. Fucking, no, don't fucking say that shit, man. <laughs> you don't even have blue eyes, dude. So you're fake. Geo, Geo, I'm being serious right now. Don't fucking say that shit. You don't have blue eyes, so I don't listen to him. I am Aryan. <laughs> Can somebody take that out of context, please, and destroy me? <laughs> You asked me for this. <laughs> Steve spends four canceled? minutes yelling at everyone that he is true Aryan. Did you know that Indians were also considered Aryan too? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Which Indians are you talking about? India, Joe, India, 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 India. Joe, what the fuck Make are sure. you talking about? Where did you get that information? <laughs> yeah, I heard that. Too. Wait, how did how did what how did them get called them. Indians? <laughs> I don't know because they, you know how we took it over like we always do. What do you think we did? Oh, that's, yeah. yeah. There's the Caucasus region. I thought they came Caucasus from Mountains. Mountains. Yeah. the steppes, right? That's like Mongolians and shit. Yeah. So we have the Caucasus Mountain range. So they just took what, another thing. What we call it is the Ariana, Aryan. Like Ariana Grande. Yes. Hey. Oh, so she's Aryan. She's Aryan. I thought she was Mexican. Is she Mexican? Because her last name is Grande. Yeah. Uh, no, she's or, or she's Starbucks. <laughs> <laughs> she's Starbucks yet. Yeah. She's as white as I'm she can sorry, be. Aryan Starbucks. Why are you yeah. sorry? I'm sorry that we took it back from you guys. <laughs> from from, from taking it back from us. I really, uh, I was offended, but I accept your apology. Thank you. Yeah. You know what's interesting okay. though? Being Afghan is a pretty big thing for me, and I would want to parade that race and be like, my friend, the Afghan Nadim the Dream, because I don't know any. It's the Afghan dream. Nadim the, Nadim Af the Afghan dream. Yes. I like anything that rhymes. I don't got it, shit with my name. It's cool. It, Cause you're the only Afghan person that I know. Nelson smells thin. And that's unique, man. Yeah. It's not like Mexican. It's like, there's so many Mexicans. So but they, many. But so there's so people many. that do it. You're not wrong. Do it to every race that's not white. Oh. But it's also what other, just so But it's not only white people. It's not only white people that do that. That's what I say though, because I, I find it fascinating. Every time he introduces me to his friends, he's like, oh, look at this Gio, she's Mexican. I know, I know. I, I say, it is Gio, I think she's Greek or some shit. <laughs> well, at least you know my name. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a good friend. Yeah. That's pretty funny. But does he say, like, oh, this is my friend Gio? Gio. 
Yeah, 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 yeah. That, that's it. It's my friend. Here she is. <laughs> um, is she supposed to be That's the shit I would do when I She's remember. married to... I would do that shit when I wouldn't remember their name, and I was like, fuck, I gotta remember their name, so I would introduce them to other people, but I knew the other person's name, so like, let's say I don't know his name, I'd be like, Ned. Uh, I'd be like, hey, uh, meet my friend Nads, and then I'd wait for you to introduce yourself, and then yeah. you say your name. Like, Nads oh. doesn't introduce I, himself. Yeah. Yeah. Then I'm gonna just change the subject to. Oh, God. Uh, Chris, this is my wife. <laughs> <laughs> um, right, right. Do you like that she calls you Nads? Because I think it sounds like testicles. Why well, did make calling, it up? I've been calling Nads. Uh, I didn't make it up. They, well, th no, she started first. In, <laughs> but I've been, been called Nads, and everybody calls me Nads. Oh. My mom, like calls, me, my mom calls me Nads. Like balls? Really? Yeah. I have so many nicknames. What's the other What's one? the other one? Harry Nutsack? No, it, it gets pretty bad, but then Boo -boo? there's Nadam from Saddam. Uh, <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. Uh, Nads, uh, Nadam, uh, Nade Man. My dad calls me Nade Man. Um, there's, there's, a, there's a shit ton. I don't know, I don't like all those. I don't dream, like Bunker. The Dream. Uh, the Dream, The Dream. That's better. Uh, sexy, I get that one a lot. Oh, yeah, yeah, I've never heard anyone say that to yeah. me. Yeah. Uh, Wait, is your is your handle still Nadim is a terrorist? <laughs> what was that from? I forgot, was that your Instagram Oh, no, name? Yeah. yeah. The yeah, Dream, where'd The Dream come from? Everyone just called, uh, Cause it rhymes? Yeah, but they call everyone like Salim The Dream, <laughs> anyone. I just prefer to call you my Afghan friend, it's easier. Yeah. My <laughs> Yeah. You set it up just to say that. <laughs> That's Always. Funny. That's smooth. My That's smooth. Friend. You're starting to see the math. I'm afraid of you now. <laughs> She's not Asian. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. I can only see it when I'm Look, slightly buzzed. You're so Greek to me, it's crazy. <laughs> There's God, have you done your 23 in me? Yeah, I have. There's no Greek in there? Uh, no. Wait, what are you, like 60% white? Pretty much. <laughs> You're practically white. There's Greek and white for sure. Very European. Greek yogurt. Yep, we love it. Yogurt. What is white? <laughs> I have no idea, dude. European. European. Yeah. I like to say Florida. <laughs> you know Falcon white. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Those are my people, dude. <laughs> Not your people, those are my people. Florida. Fine, you can take them. 